Hey, ga, hey, ga, hey, ga, hi, everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying your lovely day. In this following tutorial, I'm going to quickly show you how to set up audio lip sync for your avatar. So, very simple. All you have to do is go to menu, then settings. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go to lip sync input. And then you're going to set up to the microphone of your choice, basically. So, I'll go ahead and set mine to this one here. And basically, once you set up your microphone, it should allow your lip sync to be activated. Now, um, basically what you'll do with the gain saying, what this gain saying will do is that for Vignon, because Vignon uses OVR lip sync to do the lip sync in the first place. So what it'll tell OVR lip sync in the program, that if the gain is a bigger value, it should help make it so your, um, basically your blend shapes, you know, doing the lip sync are more sensitive but the lower the value, it makes it a little less sensitive. You'll still have audio lip sync, of course, but it'll make it a little less sensitive and maybe a little derpy on the lip sync, basically. But basically, though, set up to according however you want, basically. And then once you have that, you're going to then set up the smoothing. The more, the bigger the number, the more slower your blend shape will move, probably giving a much more natural feel, while the lower the value, the more snappier it'll be, but also at the same time will be very jittery. Um, so do keep that in mind. Um, there is a difference between how Vignan and VC Face have their um, over your lip sync settings, so do note that. But either way, though, uh, in a nutshell, that's basically how you set up the audio lip sync, though. And again, it may not fit every model, as you can kind of tell with my model, it's not really the best, per se. Um, I could adjust my blend shapes. Um, basically, just as a little extra note, by the way, uh, you can have, like, let's say, OVR lip sync blend shapes. I'll leave in the description below the website that has the reference for the OVR lip sync blend shapes, basically, which you can check out. Um, it's basically how, if you're a VR chat user, it's kind of like what the blend shape that Cat's Blender pops out. But I don't recommend using Cat's OVR lip sync blend shapes that pop out because it's literally the same quality as if you're just going to use your normal VRM blend shapes basically so honestly for the most part just either stick with your normal vr and blend shapes or if you really want more dynamic mouse movements like even more dynamic with just lip sync alone i recommend definitely look at the oculus over your lip sync blend shapes and make the blend shapes from hand but you know to each their own really i just want to give that extra info out there if you're very curious but otherwise though very simple tutorial very quick to activate and i hope you have a lovely day and i'll see you guys next time bye bye Thank you to all my Snowflake members. In case you don't know, I have YouTube membership. So if you want to further support this channel and what I do, then feel free to join the Snowflake members. Otherwise, though, just your support means so much to me and I appreciate every ounce of it. Either way, though, with that being said, though, hey, 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 bye bye, everyone. I hope to see you guys next time, okay? Bye bye.